Hello students, in this video I will be going through exercises on the power rule for exponents. So in this exercise the instruction says to simplify the given expression and our final answer should only contain positive exponents. Let's take a look at these questions here. So the power rule states that um, the exponents are going to be multiplied by one another. And if there's a product inside of the parentheses, which all of them have in this case, okay, then the exponents gets distributed with all the exponents that's within the parentheses there. So what will this become? This is equivalent to 4 to the 3rd, n to the 3rd, m to the negative 9. Remember, our final answer cannot have negative exponents, so this is equivalent to, well, 4 to the 3rd, that is equivalent to, what is that? 16 times 4, so that is 64. n to the 3rd over m to the 9th. x to the 0th, that's really 1, so really this is equivalent to y to the 4th, negative 2, or y to the negative 8th, or 1 over y to the 8th. So this is equivalent to 3 to the negative 2, x to the negative 4, y to the 0th, well, y to the 0th is 1, and 1 raised to any power is still 1. So this is equivalent to 1 over 3 squared x to the 4th, or 1 over 9 x to the 4th. This is equivalent to x to the 4th, or really just x to the 4th. This is equivalent to 2 to the 4th, x to the 4th. Or really it's 16 x to the 4th. So this is equivalent to 4 to the negative 1, y to the positive 2. Or it's y to the 2nd over 4. This is equivalent to 4a, 4 squared, a squared, which is equivalent to 16a squared. This is equivalent to 4 to the 4th, x to the negative 4, y to the negative 12. And what is 4 to the 4th? I don't know what 4 to the 4th is. Shame on me. So 4 to the 4th is 256. How could I have not known that? So this is 256 over x to the 4th, y to the 12th. x to the negative 4 to the negative 3 is x to the 12th. Two to the third, x to the sixth, y to the negative three, which is equivalent to eight x to the sixth over y to the third. Three to the negative two, a to the zeroth is just one, and one to anything is just one. And then b to the negative 2 to the negative 2, well, that's b to the 4th. Or it's b to the 4th over 9. This is 2 to the negative 1, y to the negative 4, or really it's 1 over 2 to the, times y to the 4th. Two to the fourth, u to the fourth, v to the twelfth. This is equivalent to sixteen 
u to the fourth, v to the twelfth. And last one here. 4 to the 4th, b to the 4th, a to the 16th. This is equivalent to 4 to the 4th is 256, as I found out before. There's no fraction here. So it's 256, a to the 16th, b to the 4th. And that's it.